All right, so for the last thing that I'm going to talk to you guys about today, and then you will not see me until tomorrow, um, is the book choices. Okay, so uh, at this point, you guys should have gone on your break. Hopefully everything went good with that. If not, shame on you. <laughs> but for right now, what you're going to do is there's a bunch of books right behind me, right over here, right in front of me, I guess, if you're looking at the screen, um, that you could potentially read during summer school. And I, I tried to pick a wide variety. So you've got some short classics in there. You've got some like high interest, young adult stuff in there. Um, most of which I've read. Okay, Some of them I just literally got um, right before I filmed this video down at the library. They're giving them away for free. They looked halfway decent. So I grabbed them. I'm going to put them on there. Um, you don't have to read all these books. You just have to read one of these books. Okay. And so I'm going to give you a chance to pick these now. You're not stuck today. Okay, Today is day one. Okay, We've obviously got some time, but you do have to finish reading at least one of these books during summer school. You can finish more than one if you want, but you have to at least read one. Okay. Um, I think sometimes the biggest challenge is like finding that book that works for you. So if you pick one today, I want you to start reading through it. But if in like the first chapter or two, you're not in, go put it back, grab another one, read it. Okay. Now you can't keep these books. You're not taking these home with you because I have two classes. So it's morning class, afternoon class. There might be somebody in one of those other halves that's reading the same book as you. For today, all I need you to do is go grab a book, look through the list. Okay. Try and find one that's kind of a jumps out at you, something that appeals. Um, if there's a book that somebody else wants, um, that you also want to talk to me tomorrow. I might have extra copies of some of those. Some of them, there might even be duplicates on the table. Um, so pick a book that, that you think you're going to be interested in and start reading it. Okay. Um, if even during the hour, okay, like I don't want you to, to do it real quick, but like if you've read for like 15, 20 minutes, you're like I'm not really getting into this, put it back, grab another one. Um, but by the end of next week, you do need to find one that, that's going to be yours. Okay. Um, and there are some really great books over there. Now, if you like are really struggling with it, ask Miss Herbert. Maybe she's read some of these. She can maybe give you some advice. Um, like I said, I've read almost all of them. And so I can help you out tomorrow and kind of give you some advice on that as well. But there are tons of variety over there. So pick one, uh, start reading it. Then you're going to fill out a reading log. And the reading log is not complicated. Okay, It's just going to be like, um, where did you start today? Where did you finish? That's for you. That's not for me. Okay, that's just to show you, like, are you taking advantage of the reading time that you're being given? Or are you not? Like, are you making good progress? Um, then it's going to ask you to summarize what you read. And I want you to also write um, two reflections of what you read. Okay, so that's not there's not room for that on there. <clears throat> like, it doesn't specifically say to do that, but that's what I need you to do. So you're going to summarize it. No more than two sentences. Okay, two sentences. What did you read today? Okay, big picture. What happened today? Then after that, I want you to give me two reflections. One of them. What did you think about the actual storyline of the things you read, the events that were happening? What did you think about that? The second reflection, though, needs to be about the writing style. So think about maybe the characters and how they're developed or the themes or the messages or the language. Like, did you understand it? Did you not understand it? Or the pacing? Did it move really fast? Did it move really slow? Or like even like the paragraph lengths or the chapter lengths? Was it too long or too short? Was it choppy? Was it hard? Um, think about that kind of stuff, the writing style. So one of the reflections, what did you think about the events? The other reflection, what did you think about the writing style? Just one, two sentences um, right there, and then you are done. Okay, you show that to Ms. Herbert. Once you're done with that, you guys will potentially be able to go out on your last break. Okay, so for real this time, uh, I will see you guys tomorrow. Have a great day. Make wise decisions. Merry Christmas.